welcome back to my channel. This is a 2016 favorites video. Yeah, I am not going to do like a monthly favorites. It's December. I'm going to round the year out and just pick my favorites from the year of 2016. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Let's get started. So first I should mention, mention, I'm not going to go into great detail about everything. Um, they've all been mentioned in my favorites video, so be sure to check those out if you want more detail on them. But most of them are like home or sort of like beauty products, I would say. So let's start with perfume. So I found my absolute favorite scent thus far for perfume this year. Um, well, there are two scents, but they're the same, got dust flying, um, by the same person. So we have Pure Couture and Pure Au Francais, if that's how you would say it, for women. Um, but they're by Karen Lowe. So these are both brand new boxes because I bought myself a Christmas present and I bought myself um, a re-up because mine are literally both all the way completely empty. So this one here looks like this. Cute little square bottle. Um, it's like an opaque pink. And as you can see, it is completely empty. So I bought myself a new one. Also, I'm extremely congested, so you probably think I sound like a man, but I don't even know if I can smell this a little bit, <laughs> mostly boogers, but, <laughs> um, I love the smell of these. It's a really pretty scent and it's like not too strong, but perfect for me. So this one, um, is this bottle. So it's kind of like an opaque green. Um, same designs, square, etc. And as you can see, it is empty. So I'm happy I bought myself those. I will probably not really try a new one for 2017, but um, I thought I would share these because I did find this scent in 2016. So that is my favorite scent of the year. All right, next is hair product. Um, I kind of just started doing my favorites videos this year because I just started YouTube this year. So um, I have use this product for a very long time. In between, I have tried other products um, and they just, they never work as great as this one. So I have naturally super curly hair. You probably can't tell because I've thrown it up in a bun as I usually do. Um, but I use this product whether I'm wearing it down or I'm wearing it up. It just really helps to maintain the curls and the frizz because let me tell you, my hair is crazy frizzy, like poof out to here, no exaggeration, like seriously crazy frizzy. So this is Catwalk. It is Curls Rock by Cat Rock. Can't talk. Curls Rock by Catwalk. Say that five times real fast. <laughs> um, and it's the Curl Amplifier. They come in a, they have two different packagings, but I mean, you'll find, find it next to all the Catwalk products. Um, it is seriously amazing. It's just a little serum or cream that you put into your hair and it helps with the curls and the frizz and I absolutely love it. So that is my go-to hair product for 2016. All right, next is Beauty and it is all Lush. As you guys have probably noticed on my channel, I love Lush. I have mentioned all of these products in all of my past favorites videos, so check them out if you haven't already because they are amazing, especially the Lush videos, the Lush hauls. I go into extreme depth about them because clearly I just ramble on forever about stuff. So first up, without a doubt, is Angels on Bare Skin. It is my favorite facial cleanser, bar none, absolutely the best facial cleanser that I love personally. So Angels on Bare Skin to clean your face. Followed up with some toner water. This is Aroma Water, and I absolutely love this one. A couple spritz before you do your moisturizer, and it really helps your pores absorb it, and just is friggin' amazing. Plus, it does have some moisturizing qualities, so you could carry like the travel size with you and just spritz it on your face, and then rub it in a little bit, or just let it soak in to give yourself a refresher. And then next is the moisturizer. I love Skids on Shangri La. I have tried a few moisturizers this year, and this one is so far my favorite. So I am loving this one. It's 
definitely a favorite. Who knows if I'll try another one in 2017. I try everything at Lush, but so far this has been my favorite. All right, face masks. So I've tried a few face masks this year. I have a few favorites, but I'm just gonna share one of them for you. Um, Mask of Magnimity, the self-preserving one, is so far my favorite. I am loving it. It's a great scrub for your face, super refreshing, and is just rejuvenating, and it feels so amazing afterwards. So this is definitely my favorite face mask of the year. All right, so sort of health, but not really, kind of like a home goods type product. My water bottle, I love it. So I got these, these are from motivationalbottle.com, uh, not sponsored at all by any means, just so you all know. Uh, I actually have two, uh, but this is one of them. There's cool quotes on the front, there's different quotes that they have. This one says, imagine with all your mind, believe with all your heart, achieve with all your might. And on the back, there's little measurement lines and it has times. So technically you could drink two bottles of this and you would have drank your whole eight cups, um, which is like the minimum recommended daily value or whatever of water. And so it just really helps you stay on target by 8 a.m. you should have drank this much, nine, 10, etc., cetera, et cetera. Um, My trainer has me drink three of these in a day, but still if I know that it's like nine o'clock and I'm only to here, clearly I'm well behind my daily goal. So um, I'm loving this. I struggle drinking water all the time. They have different uh, bottle caps. They have like a flip one, they have a twist off. This one is a straw one. And for me, the straw just works better and makes it easier somehow for me to drink more water. I don't know what it is, mental connection, whatever. I don't know, but this is the bottle that has helped me drink more water and get to my goal every single day. So there is that. All right, next, sort of weird, but I've loved them this year. So Bath and Body Works, soap. So this is actually one of their Holloway, Holloway, holiday, no. Halloween, I guess that is the holiday, Halloween soaps. It's the Ghoul Friend. It's got super cute packaging, but it just smells really, really friggin' good. It's like a fruity floral scent. It's just really good. It's one of their foaming ones, so it's fun as well. I'm like super congested right now. This is bad. I'm sorry, guys. I sound horrible. But anyways, I love this one. Um, next year, if they cover it with this scent again, I will probably pick up two of them because um, it does last us in our household quite a while. So I'm enjoying this. All right, last but not least in all of my favorites is a candle. As you can tell, it is greatly used. <laughs> um, it's got the black all around it and everything. Um, this is a Yankee candle. It is silver but butch. Silver birch, geez, I cannot talk. Okay, silver birch, and it is like a musky scent. I'm not even gonna attempt to smell it right now. I know what it smells like, but it's kind of got a musky scent to it, but super refreshing and I love it. So definitely one of my favorite scents of the year. All right, and that is it to wrap up my 2016 favorites. And I hope you guys enjoyed. Leave comments down below if there's anything that you want me to try in 2017. I'm open to trying them. And I will talk to you all in my next video. Bye.